undeserving of consciousness. We remember the free man. We are coterminous. There is no distance between us. Before bales of time or space may intervene. We see you still in Black Mesa. Clearly we see you in the Nailance Chamber. We bear witness to the bright eternity of the Nailance demise. You leap, you fall, we see you flash between the barriers. For a brief time you joined us, you are one between the world. Communion of the Vortescence and that other, a deeper mystery, no deeper than the Void itself. We cannot forget those whose cords you cut. Forgiveness is not ours to bestow. Unity of purpose, the shattering of common shackles, a single road we tread. Your song we sing and shall sing for eternity, no matter the consequences of this show. You have brought us grief and jubilation beyond measure. We are there still in observance of the final stroke. This is more than anyone can bear, but we will persevere. Spent on freedom. <laughs> While our only scatters at your feet, you see when the water board that bound the nailings to life <laughs> and to us. That sharp spur of hope has not dulled to this day. For once the lesser master lay defeated, we knew the greater must also fall in time. With you besides us, a talisman of victory, the day of freedom draws nigh. Your bright face obscures your darker mask. Where to now? And to what end? We call you Sib, although your mind and meaning are a mystery to us. Our finest poet describes it thus. Galambakalilaba. Far distant eyes look out through your... Something secret steers us both. We shall not name it. We have endured these chafing bonds for eons, yet a single moment of further servitude seems intolerable. How often have we slipped our yoke only to find it choking us again? Let this war end in either total victory or our extinction. No fear of the lives shall be allowed. We have survived worse across the ages. We take a stand beside you here upon this miserable rock. The way ahead is dark for What seems to you a sacrifice is merely to us an oscillation. We do not fear the interval of the We are a tapestry woven of protections. It is the same for you if only you would see. How many are there in you? Whose hopes and dreams do you encompass? Could you but see the eyes inside your own, the minds in your mind, you would see, would see, would see, we share. We are you, free men, and you are us. We have lost all dear to us. <laughs> Our cause seems hopeless. 
we shall prevail. Our finest poet describes it thus. Kalamba Kalilaba. Where to now? And to what end? We shall prevail.
sense. It's human. Hello? Take it easy in there. You're safe now. But you'll have to forgive the scanning process. We can't take any chances. Dr. Freeman? Gordon Freeman? Is that you? You've made it here this quickly. Well, Eli is going to be amazed, not to mention relieved. I'm Dr. Mossman, Dr. Judith Mossman. I've been hearing about you since long before the Black Mesa incident. Oh, Black Mesa. I do so envy you working with Eli and Dr. Klein to clear him at the top of their field. Ah, oh, there we go. You can come through now. I'll take you down to Eli. You would never forgive me if I kept you waiting. <laughs> certainly use the extra help around here. We've covered a lot of ground in this it's so much faster if we have more people to do it. We're closing, closing in on a reliable local teleport technology. Something the Combine still has, still has, still hasn't mastered. Eli thinks their portals are string-based, similar to our Kalabi Yao model, but they failed to factor in the dark energy equations. They can tunnel through from their universe, but once they're here, they're dependent on local transportation. If they she knew what we were doing with entanglement. Oh. <laughs> Listen to me. I sound like a postdoc. Doc. I'm just so excited to think that we'll finally have the chance to work together. Where was I? Oh, yes. Dr. Kleiner compressed the Zen Reason far beyond anything he imagined a black mason be. We figured out how to use Zen as an unexpected axis, effectively a dimensional slingshot, so we can swing around the border where we'll come back in local space without having to pass through. Oh, there's a guy now. Oh. All right, good. You keep right on. Eli, look who I found in the airlock. Gordon Freeman. 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 <laughs> let me, let me, let me get, let me get a look at, look at you, man. My, my God, God, you haven't changed one, 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 one iota. How do you, how do you, how do you, how do you do it? Now let's see, 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 see. The last time I, last time I saw you, I sent you up to your after the rest of the rest of the rest of the residence cascade. <laughs> I never thought it would take you this long to get on back to me. Welcome to the lab anyway. Anyway, it's not it's not Mesa, uh, uh, but it's served us well enough. It's going to be a lot more like Black Mesa with Gordon here to help. Right, you right are. MIT graduates, graduates few and far between these days. We'll get you out of that hazard suit and back into your lab coat where you belong. belong. Let me just finish up some work and work and I'll see what I can dig up. Dr. Freeman, it's been a real honor. I'm looking forward to working together. Feel free to look around. Oh, Dr. Freeman, you should stay with Eli. Go on, I'll rejoin you shortly. Fine science, scientist, Judith. She was up for your, your job at Black Mesa, but you had to her out with your Innsbruck experience. Dr. Breen. He's the administrator of this whole vile business now. He ended the end of an hour of war by managing Earth's surrender. The Combine rewarded him with power. We're still not, still not, still not, shut, shut, sure what that, what that does. Alex brings in this 
strangest things. Said you were here. Can't, can't believe, can't believe he made it so quickly on foot. What? I believe he broke your record, record, honey. Well, he earned it. I guess you proved you can handle your silly about daughter. There's nothing Gordon can't handle, handle. with the possible exception of shouldn't of you. Dad, please. <sighs> Take a look at this course. This Vortigaunts really gave really saw me so I could come see Gordon. Anyway, I should be in here working on the portal. portal. I have the repairs well in hand. Someone misjudged the capacity of the combined thyristor. <laughs> Are you blaming me? No, not at all. It was a calculation error, not a mechanical problem. Then maybe you should let you should let me do the calculations next time as well as installing it. Alex, really? Sometimes I think you deliberately misunderstand me. <clears throat> Alex, why don't you take Gordon along and give him some practice with the gravity gun? Sure. Come on, Gordon. Let's go have some fun. The zero-point energy field manipulator is not a toy. <sighs> Let's get out of here. I see you've met Dr. Mossman. She's one of the main reasons I spend so much time outside. You should hear her drone on about on about how it should have been her in the Black Mesa test chamber that day. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't be talking behind her back. It just gets a bit claustrophobic down here. That's the old passage to Ravenholm. We don't go there anymore. We used to be able to go right up there to Ravenholm. It was an old mining town inhabited by some escapees from City 17. Believe me, that tunnel was sealed for a reason.
So, here we are. The scrapyard. This is a gravity gun my father was talking about. You can call it the zero point energy field manipulator if you really want to. It's designed for handling hazardous materials, but we mainly use it for heavy lifting. Give it a try. The primary trigger emits a charge. You can punch stuff instead of flying. I found it handy for clearing minefields. Secondary trigger lets you grab things. You can throw them with the prime. Once you pick something up, you can drop it gently by pressing your secondary trigger again. Pick up the stuff, toss it. Pull stuff over from a distance. Dis Try grabbing those barrels from barrel ledge out there. Try stacking some things, some things. Grab something with your secondary trigger and press the same trigger again to drop it gently. Call dog. He loves to play fetch. Dog! Come! Good doggy! Gordon, this is dog. My my dad built him built him to protect me when I knew when I was a kid. First model is about yay high. I've been adding to him ever since. Have a night, boy. Okay, dog, let's play catch with Gordon. You'll need to use the gravity gun. Go ahead, dog. Throw! <laughs> Get 
your dog like to play fetch? I didn't tell you who'd be fetching, did I? Okay, Gordon, let's try something else. Dog, throw something bigger. No dog. No, no boy. Down. Put him down. Scanners. Airlock stuck in a full auto cycle. Is Gordon still with you? He's right here. Good. I want you to. to, to... Dad? Take Gordon out of here. Head for the coast. Do not go through rape. Dad? Dad! Damn it! Dog, open the airlock. Get us out of here. Hurry! Now! Parent of Get it open! Get it open! Father. Dog, take Gordon to the Ravenholm Tunnel, then circle around and try to meet up with me. Hurry! 